you, you, you know, how, how much of an impact, you know, that those poor decisions that were made made in regards to the economy, you know, up up to and before the. I, I mean, I'm 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 absolutely baffled right now at the state of our economy right now when. You know, things that could have been avoided, you know, What's several that, months is, ago. Is the economy, has the economy hit you or your family? Have you guys, any of you lost jobs as a result? Uh, the job that I went to in, uh, to in Kentucky, uh, I was let go from, you know, and, and I've only just recently gotten back onto my feet uh, with, with a new job at a startup company. You know, it's, uh, it was paying less than, it, than, I, than I was at before, you know, with my current job, you know, but... I had to take what I can get. My wife right now has just started the job uh, working at a at, as as an occasional uh, standby cook at uh, at a kitchen in a retirement home just outside of Nicholasville. It's actually in a place called Wilmore, and uh, you know, which are, we're and the it's you know the the economy. I it isn't hitting us as bad really as a lot of people. You know, uh, a, a lot of people with like big mortgages. You know, the borrowed heavy, heavy during during the whole subprime mortgage mortgage uh, stuff that was going on. You know, where where people were like taking on mortgages that they knew deep down inside them that they knew they could not afford, but they wanted to shift the houses and they wanted to shift the credit as as quickly as they could. But thankfully for us, when we bought our house here about this time last year, we 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 took we didn't take on that much of a mortgage uh, liability. You know? I mean, we got like a uh, an, eight, an 80, 90 grand house, you know, and and we're paying it off. We pay on time, you know. We got our car payments, you know. Uh, we we're down to one vehicle now. We had to, you know, we had to sell the van, you know. But but I mean, it's it, it it's hard, you know. It's, and but um, but I mean we but I mean we're continuing to stay positive and ju and just really just work away work away through this. And I mean I um, I mean I have a lot of sympathy for people that you know that that are in tough times right right now. But but it but by the same token, I I can't I can't really feel sorry for for people that, uh, that, that have actually put themselves in in real financial crisis right now by taking on a lot of financial liability you know like uh, like going going out and paying like 150 200 thousand 250 thousand dollars for a house when they're only making you know like 40 thousand a year you know I mean how how enough how enough they're gonna pay that off if if one of them loses their job if if you know, if the income doesn't come in, you know, it's just horrible. It's just, I mean, if so many people are so hurting, that's unbelievable. It's a, I mean, and and of course, a lot of people are frustrated by who gets bailed out and who doesn't. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> tell me about it. Yeah. Tell. Yeah. Tell me about it. I mean, I mean, I I, I feel sorry for for the auto workers, really, to be to be honest with them, because because you know. I mean, they 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 they've seen the they they've seen the writing on the wall for ages. That you know we have we have to be more responsible environmentally. You know, so, so I mean, like consu consumers have been right right have been putting the writing on the wall for them for for months, if not years. That they they they're no longer buying the trucks. You know, that that se that seem to be rolling out these plants at like an. Ex at an expedited rate, you know, and if nobody's buying the vehicles, you know, then there's not going to be any income coming in, you know, and they have to shut down the, the plants and stuff like that, and, you know, it is a mess. And the auto chiefs, you I know, mean, I don't even, I mean, we're going to do it, we're going to do a segment tonight if everything goes as planned about California. Um, California's got a, a, a big a six ballot initiatives tomorrow, but I don't know how California's going to make it. They are in deep trouble. and. You know, and it, I think that's just the beginning. Yeah, uh, uh, ca yeah, Calif California. I mean, I mean, it is isn't that a mix of political culture? I mean, you've got you've got two senators, okay, that re that that represent the le the left, uh, the the, li the pretty much the li liberal sector of politics within the United States. I mean, I mean who are they? Barbara Boxer and Diane Wayne Feinstein. Feinstein, yeah, Feinstein, yeah. And 
and then and then you've got a governor who's who, who's Republican, and and you and you've got how can you get how can you reach a consensus in the Golden State? I mean, the, and and really, there are issues being discussed in California that. Well, they've got the other problem that they have is they have a, they have a, a, so many different subcultures. They've got a very wealthy culture. They've got a huge immigrant culture. They've got an Im, uh, they've got illegal immigrants that are there. They've got middle class. They've got so many competing demands, and the state is so giant. It's so big that you know that it's it's hard to come up with the perfect solution. But they're also they've got so many taxes there. They get hit left, right, and center with taxes, which is driving some of the business now out of the state. And and you know and and I mean I take the, I mean that I mean now all that's going to be taken into consideration when they discuss issues, but to be to be honest, I mean a lot of, a lot of California citizens' time is being preoccupied with the whole gay rights issue. I mean that I mean to be, I mean come on, I mean that I mean there are so more many more pressing issues right now in terms of in in terms of the economy how how people are, are going are going about living their lives right now whether they whether they're going to have a job whether they whether they're going to be able to pay the mortgage the car payment you know and then you've got then you then then you then you've got issue about gay rights you know and stuff like that you know i mean there's there i mean there i mean that's the whole thing about california there's so many distractions that are in, that are in place there, bringing them out of the real issues. To be honest with him, and you know, I mean, I mean, with the whole right, I mean, when when the whole gay rights was being discussed at length, they should have been trying to tackle more pressing uh, issues. And I mean, that's my opinion on that. I mean, stuff like this should have been tackled and discussed weeks, months, years ago. Indeed, and and, and then. They they wouldn't have put themselves in this much trouble, you well, know, econ economically, you know, politically. But, well, they're in deep trouble, and I'm gonna be in deep trouble if I don't go work. Uh, I probably should uh, I should probably uh, say goodbye. Uh, but I enjoyed oh, no, talking oh, to you. I enjoyed talking. I, no. I I hope you'll call back on Skype again. I mean, I'd like to talk about all these issues with you. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. And I'd, I'd 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 love to talk to you again. I mean, I mean, the initial call that you the the that you gave me. Uh, I mean, was was totally out of the blue. I mean, I looked up on my display and I said, "Greta Van Susteren is calling." Well, well you the, you had you had uh, Sky I'm trying to figure this Skype out, and I see that you had uh, had skyped me, so I was skyping back or something. Anyway, I'm going to master it. Believe me, I'm going to get better at this. Oh, not a problem, not a problem. Uh, if, you, if you need any if you need any tips or advice on on doing on doing this kind of thing, uh, please give me a call. In I, fact, Skype. In fact, Skype has made my life a heck of a lot easier because I can work from home now. I, know, I don't but, have to drive into work. I mean, it's about ten miles to work. Granted, it's not as far as a commute as it is for a lot of people, but you know, any any little bit helps. You no, know? and I mean, I love. I mean, I love it. No, and, and I'll be and I'll be. And I'll be ready to give you all the advice in the world, you whether it's whether it's Skype, Twitter, Facebook. <laughs> you shouldn't don't, have said don't. that. You shouldn't have said that because you know I'm gonna take you up on it. I'm gonna drive you nuts. So you shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Thank you, no, though. No I'll call for advice. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, Greta. Have a great show. You too. Thanks.